Hi, I'm Lisa Ryan, Chief Appreciation Strategist at Gratigy. Welcome to the five thank yous a day gratitude challenge. Our 30 day challenge and we are on day eight. Isn't gratitude great on day eight? Are you feeling it? Now we talked earlier about gratitude's effect on our heart. I had mentioned it and didn't give you a lot of details and I want to share some of those with you today. Because I think that it will help you see how gratitude helps us physically. The Institute of Heart Math conducted a study in which they took their research, their participants, and they hooked them up to a monitor. And they put them through a period of frustration. And then they looked at their heart rate variability, which is basically the space between the heart rate, the heart beats, how the heart beats. And when they put their participants through frustration, this is what it looked like. Very jagged, very inconsistent. When they took that same group of people and put them through a period of appreciation, it went like this. Smooth, consistent, it looked balanced. So if you find yourself in that stress response, I want to show you a, a quick exercise that you can do once, twice, 10 times a day, whenever you feel stress coming on, so you can release that. You can either just concentrate on the area around your heart, or you can take your hand and place it where it fits the best, on your heart. And go to your heart and concentrate on that area. Maybe you'll breathe in and breathe out and feel like it's coming, in, the breath is coming in and out through your heart. Really focus on that area around your heart. And when you feel that connection, think of something for which you are extremely grateful really feel the emotion of gratitude for that person, for that event, for whatever happened. Go to the place where you can feel all the physical emotions of that event and just stay with it. Feel it. And then ask yourself the question, how can I look at this stressful situation differently? And then listen to what your heart has to say. The Institute of Heart Math calls this the freeze frame technique. And when you let it go, it takes you out of that stress response and into an area that's much more positive. Again, you can do it once a day, a couple times a day, anytime you feel that frustration or that stress coming on, and it will make a difference. You go to your heart and your heart supports you. Day eight has been great. I so appreciate you. I'll see you tomorrow and let's be grateful.